I'm on Caroline Street along the popular Rappahannock River Heritage Trail, and on this week's edition we're going to tell you about a great new activity along this trail. Alright, on this week's edition I'm with Callie Brown, who's the Outdoor Recreation Supervisor for the City of Fredericksburg in the, in the Department of Parks, Recreation and Events. And we're standing on the Rappahannock River Heritage Trail along a new section of the trail that has a new really cool initiative that, that Callie helped spearhead. Um, so Callie, tell us about what we have here. So what we've put in here is the Story Walk. We're calling it Fredericksburg Story Walk. And Story Walk was actually developed by a lady named Ann Ferguson in Vermont. And she spearheaded this there and the idea has boomed all over the country. People are installing story walks. It gives an opportunity for families to come out and read a story with their families as they're walking. It gives a little incentive for little ones to keep up while they're walking and um, it gets people interested in books. It, it looks like there's there's looks like there's 20, 20 panels here, right? Yeah, and the there's story 20 plays signs. out across the twenty. Each each the book is split up so that each page is on a different sign, so you have to walk a little ways to get to the next part of the story. And um, what we plan on doing, these signs are pretty cool. They actually have um, the ability to open up and change out. So we're going to change out these books as we go. The first book we have in there is called Bear Cup Came Along, and it's about a group of animals that realize they need each other and they need the river. Um, to work together as an ecosystem, um, and by the end of the story, they end up all friends together. So, so tell us exactly uh, where we are on the trail right now. So we are on the Rappahannock River Heritage Trail. We're right between Old Mill Park. Old Mill Park is right down the road here, and on the other side is Ford Street. And um, yeah, you, you're, we're right on Caroline Street. And so, talk a little bit about the the how the idea for this came about. Like, how did you find out about it and the process sure. for that um, led to this? Yeah, the idea, it actually, somebody in the office came up with it and um, we just kind of ran with it. So somebody found it online. Like I said, a lot of people do this all over the country and somebody posted about something they were doing in their city or their town and we thought it would be a great addition to our town. Yeah. Uh, and then I saw, I noticed that the last couple of panels are, you can use for, you're posting some of the events that you all have coming up and, the, yes. and then there's a safety message it looks like on the last yes. one. Yes, yeah. so we have 20 signs. This book right here only filled up 17 signs. We wanted to have room for future stories. And so the last few signs have um, upcoming events and programs, information on that. And then we also took this opportunity since we're right next to the river and this book features rapids just like our river has. We took the opportunity to make this a learning opportunity for safety in our on our river. Great. Well, thanks, Callie. I think it's a really neat addition. Um, so encourage people to come out and, and check out the Fredericksburg Story Walk along the, the beautiful Rappahannock River Heritage Trail. Yet another reason to come out and try this, this beautiful yeah. trail. Yeah, definitely. So kudos to you for all your efforts and thanks for joining us. Yeah, thank you for having me. And if you come out with your family and um, take pictures of your little ones on the walk, and post them online. Use the hashtag FXBG Story Walk so we can see you having fun on the on the trail. Okay, sounds good. All right, so that'll do it for this week's edition. We appreciate you watching, and we'll um, see you next week. Be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel and hit the notification bell so you can get an email each time we put out a new video. And also subscribe to our Fred Focus newsletter, uh, which comes out every Thursday. Thank you for watching, and we'll see you next week.